Wild. Hey guys, Spray and Pray here, and welcome back to Yoga Universalized 4. We are playing as Arabia. We can see pretty much all of the known world. The new world is still a mystery to us, but. Uh, we are well on our way to westernizing, which I believe once you westernize, then you can see everything that western techs can see. Um, so that's going to be interesting. So we'll open our eyes to that. We're falling behind in technology, unfortunately, but uh, that, that's kind of to be expected when you're westernizing. So yeah, as soon as that's over, though, we'll be western, so we'll have a lot easier time teching up. We just integrated Elodia, which is cool. We got their 7,000 units, so we don't have to make more of those. That's nice. Kind of luck out there. We have a little fleety fleet down here. Which there's just one cog. We don't need that, really. Um, but we did get when Unfortunately, we got a lot more uh, different religions down here that we're going to have to worry about converting. Um, and I'm sure there's some autonomy that we need to deal with. So let's see. Where's the unrest? All right. We're going we're gonna to bump that up a little bit wherever they need it. It's already at 75%, so we're going to be basically getting nothing from these lands, except for we won't getting, be getting revolts from these lands, which is uh, better than nothing. And then later on, once things settle down, we can afford to start lowering this autonomy. It's just during my westernization, I don't want to deal with any of that shit, you know? I want everything to go smooth. Smoothly. What's our force limit now, by the way? Just wondering. 57? Oh, that's pretty good. How are we doing versus vice, like, the Ottomans and stuff? Ottomans, uh, we're actually on par now with, which is... Oh, no, there's 68, not 58. That sucks. Venice, though, Venice is our ally still, correct, please? Okay, good. We're still allies. So, Venice and I could probably beat the Ottomans by ourselves, but Venice... Also is allied with Austria, which is like OP as fuck. So if Venice initiates a war against the Ottomans, it's like basically Christmas time for us. So hopefully that happens soon. Anyways, we have a vacant spot here for our advisor, but there's no plus one advisor. There's only plus two, which is like really expensive. So fuck that. I'm not paying for that shit. Balukistan is fabricating claims on us. That's hilarious. Why? Who do you think you're gonna... You're a vassal of the Timurids. The Timurids aren't gonna do shit for you. Yeah, the Timurids, you know what they're gonna do? They're gonna declare war on me, and I'm gonna fuck them up. And then they're just gonna do nothing for you. We're gonna lower maintenance so we can make a little bit more money per month, and I wanna build... Um, uh, we can't build anything, besides maybe units, but... Oh god, we're never gonna become uh, religiously unified. Oh my gosh, look at all that shit. That's gonna take forever. But oh well, our name has become a little bit funny looking. Ooh, mercantilism? Or, ooh, I like this mercantilism. Give me that. Mercantilism is the best. What we could do is make more uh, ships. So, can we afford to make five? I just want to make five more to have enough to be our force limit, which is so we can exactly make five. So that's nice. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna unwesternize at all. It's a pipe dream. Alright, we have some free diplomats now. What's our relation we'll improve relations with the Ottomans. Improve relations with Timurids. Are we already improved with them? No. Is Uzbek still our ally? Yeah. So they they they'll be an asset against the Timurids if it comes to that. And then maybe we could improve relations with Muscovy as well. Just improving relations all around will make us stronger. Ooh, okay, that's not going to be helpful though. Because we're going to probably be laying pretty low for this time period while we're westernizing. All right, let's get all of our trade ships together. Go back to patrolling Alexandria. How much do we make off trade now? That's that's actually the biggest part of our income is trade. Alright, Austria thinks plus 15 of us. That's nice. Hungary we didn't do yet. Let's go do Hungary now. 
We're just gonna improve relations with all the guys around us now that we have four diplomats, which is freaking insane. So we're gonna abuse them by making them go improve relations with us all the time. I need the PAD to help with my religious strength or conversion strength. Missionary strength. Okay, we're going to be pretty much stuck at this level of stability until our westernization finishes. Okay, we got a revolt. Let's raise our uh, army maintenance. Oh, but look at that, we're not losing anything, so that's good. That's especially impressive when you consider that uh, we should probably be losing money since we don't have any positive stability. We're going to ignore them. We're probably going to have a shitload of rebels now, but I mean, what are you going to do? How much longer? 58? Oh god, two more years? Shit. All right, we're maxed on our stuff. So yeah, we gotta we better prepare because we're gonna be killing all these rebels now. So let's go ahead and make sure that we have an army ready. Um, where's the rest of this army? Oh, down here. All right, uh, and we're gonna monitor them as they pop up. Oh, we got one down over here. Really? I didn't even realize that. Go kill that guy, and then uh, move somewhere where there's a good force limit. Alright, and then we're going to build more troops. We may or may not have to take loans, but whatever. As long as we finish our westernization, I will be a happy camper. Okay, I'm not comfortable spending more than that, so that's all I'll spend. How many more months of this do we have to endure? Not much. We only have... we're very close. Just 10% left. It's gonna be slower than that, but uh, we only have about a year left on the thing that it's telling me. We're gonna merge all these guys up in our, in our capital, because our capital has a really good force limit. 38 is like ridiculous. It's pretty much like the Paris of down here. 111 nationalists rise up in Dongla. Dongla is over here, correct? No. It's down here. No. Where the fuck is Dongla? I'm stupid. I, I know it's... I'm so stupid. I'm gonna have to look it up. I know I just... I remember looking at it. <sighs> Dong. Dongla? Yeah, it's right there. Okay. So we're gonna march our army over here with our super cool leader guy. Um, there's going to be way too... We're going to take a buttload of attrition. I just know it already. Which sucks, but... Oh my god, that's so much attrition. 9.8 right there. Ugh, god. That's just like murder on our troops. Alright. And now, after this, we're going to split them up. Oh, come on. How are you going to try and say that I'm going to lose that shit? Really? Alright, so we're going to try to split them up so that they don't take attrition. Alright, now we'll move those guys back. We can do some more conversions. Oh, hooray! We're minus three stability. That's cool. Let's see. Uh, so we already did Naples. No, let's do Naples. And uh, maybe like one of these guys over here. Uh, we already we rivaled Great Britain, but I don't know why. I mean, it's, it don't really matter. Muscovy doesn't like us much. 
Do we have room for another alliance? Yeah, we do. Maybe we'll pick the take the golden horde as another ally just to have one, for the sake of having one. Um, but just first, is there anybody over here that will take an alliance? Any of these guys that we've been improving relations with? Oh, uh, hungry will. All right, let's take let's give them an alliance then. Never mind. So now, if we fought against the Ottomans, oh, we we need to get above minus three civility. I'll take out some loans for that, I guess. How much longer do we have on this westernization? Oh my god. Okay, December of this month, or this year. Oh god, we're gonna die so much. Let's see if we can- is there any- is there any rebels we can support over here? I just wanna see if it'll even be an option. Wow, support rebels, okay. Revolted. Whatever. This is good news. Oh, so our ships cost less now, but it doesn't matter. Because I already built my whole fleet. Okay. Oh, sweet. We got our... No more... No Catholics now, at least. Oh my god, we did our westernization. Thank you, Jesus. Okay. So why are we so expansive? Alright, we're gonna get that guy. The Ottomans declared war on Kara and Connor Coinlu. Alright, well we need to save up power points now. Uh, and fix our stability and everything. I'll give Kara Coinlu some slack. They can definitely have what a military access from us. Another Dongla rebellion, really? Okay, so this time we're gonna be smart about it. I'm just not I'm not gonna march just like a gazillion guys down there. Alright, so we'll do that one first. How many is it? Eleven? Alright, and then we'll do that one then. And that one there. Yeah, we need to get these two guys from Karakoinlu because they uh, are our culture. Okay, and so it's going to be 11 of them. Okay, so we didn't take nearly as much attrition that time, which is nice. I don't know why we take such heavy losses when we fight these stupid Donglies guys. Okay, another conversion to do. Go for it. Head up the side there, head here. Uh, we're going to drop our maintenance now to... Why? You're fired. Too expensive. Why are we not making as much? Oh, because our stability is shit, that's why. Okay, so at least, uh, what are these guys doing? Berber and Dongla, all this shit. Um... Ends when unrest lower than one, and stability at least one. Well, what's our unrest? 1.6? That's not so bad. Once we get our stability up, it should fix that. Alright, so let's go to see how much it costs. 159? Oh my god, internal conflicts makes it that much? Are you shitting me? Ugh, that's so stupid. That's so expensive! 50%? Oh my god. How are you ever supposed to recover from that shit? It's gonna take a long time. Luckily we don't have much unrest because most of our shit's like accepted culture and all that. So that's kind of in our favor. Alright, let's merge our armies up over here. We don't have any other rebels hiding out, right? Like we did the last time. 
So France, you don't want to be my ally? Oh, they do want to be my ally. Okay. Oh, sweet, we got a new Sultan too, that's good. Alright, gain PD, gain PD, gain PD, gain PD, and gain PD. Sounds great. I loves me that PD. And now look at that, our tech's so cheap. Wait, why is it so expensive still? 500? I thought it was like 400 to tech up. I'm sure this one's like, oh wow, that's, that's really cheap. Okay. Let's keep on converting. Oh god, these Coptic ones are so hard. Are you seriously still fabricating shit on me, bitch? Get out of here, Blukistan. Another Dongla Rebellion? That's so stupid. Quit it. Ugh. Why do we have keep having these stupid rebellions in Dongla? Um. He's gonna cost nine ducats a month. I can't afford that. All right, so that's how it's gonna be then. I don't know how they expect me to get the stability up that high, but whatever. Uh, and we have no, really, we have no general? Are you shitting me? Our general died too? Is everything bad gonna happen to me? Am I gonna have to complain all the time now? Alright, I guess we're gonna send that guy to Dongla. And we're gonna probably want the less national unrest. I'd rather have less unrest than manpower modifier. The Ottomans like us now for no reason, but it doesn't really matter. Oh, we need to start paying. I'm probably not gonna be happy for not paying. Yeah, that would have went poorly. Ugh, that's so expensive. Fuck that shit. Stability is at least one. Okay, whatever. Those rebels are dead now. I can start making money again. Uh, shit. What are we gonna do? Um, let's see about getting that stability up. Oh, there we go. All right, we can do stability now. Thank God. Brilliant. Trade steering. Can we get some free stability? That'd be great. Oh my, how much is it? Oh, it's still 159. That's not so bad, I guess. Oh, shit, we have five loans. Because oh. we had to pay that 300 that one time just so that we didn't get any more stupid fucking revolts. Oh well. At least, like, now it looks like we're not going to get any more revolts. So, happy me, happy me. Uh, does air... What are you, religious... You are Sunni, Air? Oh my god. Uh, do you want to be my vassal? Is too technologically advanced. Oh. Okay. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. That's going to make it... We can't vassalize these guys. I think uh, Muslims you can. But not... Um, I don't think we can even do Indians. Yeah. Muslim, I think you can though. So let's see. Uh... That's not an option. Nomad, you definitely can't vassalize as a Western. I wish the Ottomans would get into like some fucking war or something like that, because it's really annoying that they're just OP as hell all the time. 83 force limit, my ass. I mean, check out our alliances, though. We're pretty strong. France, Venice, Uzbek, Golden Horde. Those are all really good allies. Let's see, uh, do we, we could declare war and none of our allies are coming? Really? Really? Oh, well, France is a bazillion dollars in debt because they're getting their ass raped by Austria. 
So hopefully Venice will come. Venice would come in a defensive war, is what they're saying basically. Uh, sucks that we can't change the focus because we probably really we really needed to be on this. Because our because we need to get up to one stability for some stupid ass reason. Oh well, like we're gonna get religious unity before we get to that. Just so you guys know. Hopefully we can get a little bit more piety. Because we're kind of, I feel like broken right now with our stability so low, which is unfortunate. I guess we'll do that. Why not? There's still no plus one advisor for military, but we already have the extra shit, so that might not be so bad. This guy's 23. Oh, well, that's pretty good. And our oh god, he's not, he's our new heir is below average. So if we get a chance, I'd like to kill him. <sighs> Why does the player always get such shitty heirs? I don't know. Repay a loan. Uh, we could probably build some military buildings, but we're going to probably want to focus on doing tech now that we can, uh, now that it's cheaper. It's not a gazillion dollars. Ducats. These guys have 12. No, the Ottomans are only at 11. That's good. So this little province over here is probably really nice because we have all these neighbors that are going to tech up before us. Like Pisa and the Papal State and Naples. Okay, I'm definitely not losing any fucking uh, stability because we need that really badly. So I could care less really what happens. Um, Crete. Uh, we can't fabricate on Crete because they're, they're too far away. Um, so who do we need to improve relations with? We might be able to vassalize, well, no, air because they're, they're um, sub Saharan. We're not going to be able to vassalize them. Uh, going to embargo them. Maybe Sweden will send uh, in pure relations with. Um, Portugal, we could probably do. Spain. Do we top them off? No, well, we could top them off. And then what about Venice and France? Looks like Venice needs some love, so we'll send the guy to Venice that we're going to get back in a few days. We'll go make love with the Venice, the Venetians. Improve the relations. Yes, mamma mia, spaghetti. Ugh, this is going to be such a difficult road to do. For the stupid stability shit. Because we have to, we have to hit this button two more times. Which means we need three hundred points, and we only get six per month. So it's gonna be like eternity. It's gonna be five, fifty, fifty months. Yeah, I think. Yeah, fifty months. So five years till we can actually boost it that much. From now. All right. Let's uh, let's go ahead and oh, we can do an idea. But yeah, no, we're gonna do tech now that we're now that we're the right tech, or uh, now that we westernize, we're gonna do tech, texts, texts, not text. Uh, let's repay a loan. Oh God, look at the loans now; they're like even worse. Are we making money though? Good, at least now more. So, looks like it. What's wrong with our trade? Why do we have uh, well we must have lost a positive modifier. Oh, I think one more idea and we'll get this uh production efficiency. So we might end up taking this. I don't know. And then this is awesome. The attrition for enemies and uh land attrition will be greatly appreciated for us. So hopefully we can chug through those soon. And Yep. But the Spanish square will give us extra Muslim musketeers, which are a lot better than what the current infantry, because we haven't had an infantry upgrade in a while. Um, I'm pretty sure the Ottomans get their infantry upgrade before us, so 
that's gonna be nice and it looks like we're kind of just rolling through these so i mean it's possible that we'll be seeing that we get religious unity finally wow why is this so so hard to convert Wow, that's stupid. <sighs> Maybe just the other ones have just more bonuses, I guess? Mercantilism? Oh, hell yeah, give me more mercantilism. More mercantilism all day, mercantilism. And Spanish Square, too. Let's get ourselves those uh, Muslim Musketeers. Three musketeers. <laughs> I like candy. Uh, who's this? The Timurids? Oh, but it's being unseaged. I would like to take over those two provinces just because um, they're my culture. So hopefully we can try to get that done. Alright, so once again I have a question, uh, what do I do with my diplomats? The knights and papal state, really? They only had to fight those two? Weird. <sighs> I, I think we're going to probably start, to, I think the next idea we're going to take is the, uh, is going to be... Is going to be like the either the exploration ideas or the expansion ideas, because I want to get a colonist. Maybe exploration because it comes with well two we don't really need. I think we'll do probably better with the expansion, because this is more geared towards us. I think. So next time we get a chance, we'll do that. When do we get our next level of? Oh, Caravel isn't until next level, so. Um, we'll get a lot more trade power out of those, I believe. Let's go ahead and repay another loan when we get the chance. Okay, we need 192 to repay our loans currently. I'm gonna convert these guys. We could do another stability increase, finally. Ugh, we're finally at zero. We just need to get one more boost and then we'll be way better off we'll be waking making way more money and our stability will probably cost like nowhere near as much and it's getting cheaper too because our religious unity is going up so we're not it's not it's getting cheaper as we go along here i would prefer i'd be really kind of excited if we got a little bit more uh pious though Probably delete that ship. It's just costing us money for no reason. Let's take a look. Uh, we have two more. We can do two more, I guess, ships in a minute. Sometime later. Uh, whoop, that was a little laggy. I hate, I don't like the auto saves all the damn time. It's kind of annoying. I am happy though. Because the... Uh, okay, we'll do that. I'm happy because I was thinking that we might have more issues with the whole cloud saving thing. But we haven't, so that's good. Uh, so after we get all uh, colonizers and stuff like that, I don't know what we're going to do. Maybe we'll go colonize uh, Australia again and make Arabia in Australia. Common or uh, New Arabia instead of New Zealand. Stuff like that. That'd be cool. Uh, let's see if we can augment this guy. And still no, no thing. Let's go. We need more admin points. And we're going to have an admin idea too. So yeah, we really need the points. Alright, we can repay that first loan. Good. I'm not going to lose those points. Fuck that. And I don't think... I'm pretty sure Mecco has so little uh, unrest already. Yeah, it didn't even matter. Perfect. I like to see that. How are these little provinces? Are they settling down over here? 
So soon, when those things go, we might be able to do this in Oman now. Or the autonomy has just gone down by itself, which is cool. So that's nice. The autonomy has just been going down by itself, so we don't really have to worry about it too much. Alright, and then so next next ability boost will be uh, the last one that we need to do to get rid of this stupid internal conflicts bullshit. Ooh, gain PD. Yay, okay, so I, I, I took the PD just because now we're at 100% uh, conversion strength. So we can finally get religious unity because it's like been forever that we've not had religious unity. Ooh, I wonder if the Timurids are going to 100% annex Kara Coinly or like vassalize them or something dumb like that, which would suck. I think we have one more loan now. Sweet. All right, we're getting rid of these. Now we're going to be rolling through these, so that's nice to see. And then we only have the one guy left. I want to get a reflation. Is there an inflation reduction guy that's cheap? No, he's the plus three, which is like super expensive, so fuck that. We're actually making some good money now, but we'll be making 33%. Like, we'll be making a lot more, hopefully, after we do the last ability, which we can do now. All right, good. We lost the internal conflicts. Yay! So nothing can go wrong now. Oh good, we have trading in coffee, that's cool. And how much money are we making now? 20, so we're making 14 ducats more than we were earlier, so that's fantastic. Let's repay all of our loans. Convert, oh and look at that, the conversion is so much better now too. I was wondering why it was taking so long. It's like stupid long. Oh and finally we got a plus one, that's great. Everything's working out. Alright, and we can pay for our troops, too, to reinforce. Although I don't think they had to reinforce much. Ugh, finally. Ooh, we can get a new, we're gonna get a new, uh... Poduero? We're gonna get, no. We're gonna get, uh, some... Oh, look at that, so we have Venice, France... Us. Alright, we won that navy battle, which but that's gonna be short lived. Uh so what's the Ottomans for some oh god, they have so much so many troops. Alright, well they just came at the exactly the right time, so uh Venice, please kick ass, I hope. And uh France, I could definitely use your help. So if you could get like military access from Austria or something like that, that'd be fantastic. I really don't want them to just do nothing. I would cry. What's this war about? It's the uh, reconquest of Rahaba, which is this one here. So as long as we defend that, we'll get our war score ticking in our favor. All right, so let's move our troops together. So who's fighting against us right now? Tlemcen, all those shitheads. Okay, uh, Desiret, I'm going to probably assume you're going to just get your units killed there. But it looks like Tunis is retarded and left some units there, so that's nice of them. Alright, and we can get our troops safely home without engaging the massive Ottoman fleet. That's nice. Alright, and we're going to need to build some more units too because our limit is what? Okay, we have actually, our, we're close to our limit, but I'd like to get some mercenaries. So let's, let's send this guy up there and see what happens. I'm going to recruit another general, but that obviously did not work. Because I think we have shit tradition, yeah, so. That's okay, we'll stick with our guy that we already have. And we'll see if we can't draw the Ottomans out into, like, some stupid fight. Um, oh, great, a Regency Council? Really? That's some Navy tradition, that's nice, I guess. So we'll see if we can't draw them out into some dumb fight. And we'll do our best to protect the Wargol. Uh, but it looks like, oh, so he's got 40k over there. And he's got 50k here. Uh, if we go out and help, are we going to help much? Probably not. 
No, because they've got heavies and shit like that, so no, our trade ships aren't going to do anything. And unfortunately, that means that France is also going to have issues like that, so I hope that they can somehow get to us, maybe through Savoy and Milan. So they have 50k up here, we have some more troops coming, um, but we're going to probably need to heavily outnumber them to actually be able to beat them. And they're just sending even more troops over now. How many troops do the fucking Ottomans have? 15,000? 151,000! Are you fucking kidding me? That's like impossible to deal with. Oh, you want to be in my Arabia? <laughs> I wish. Oh wow, they're not even going to take that, really? They, I can't even suggest an offer. They're like, ugh, we won't even accept a, uh, suggestions. Maybe if I take uh, both these armies and attack over here, let's see what happens. If I take 50k and just drop that on their ass. We will cross a river, but I'm pretty sure... Alright, so they're going to send 11 more units in, really? No, we're going to win. Nice. 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 So we snipe that army really quick out from under them. Um, but I don't I don't know. We're, guys, this is going to be some shit right here. I mean, even with France in the war with us, which they're not going to send any troops over, we barely have more units than they do on the board here. Um, this is going to be like a guerrilla war, because there's no way we're going to win just all out, even if we try our damnedest. Um, where's their generals, though? Uh, so let's, let's retreat here. We're going to split in half and retreat separately. Let's see if we can't get them to do something stupid. Uh, we're going to take a loan or two. We're going to have to take loans because there's no other way to fight them. Um, so let's, and we're going to have to be very smart with our engagements. Uh, this is probably going to be really intense, guys. So we're going to save it for the next episode. Sorry to, like, kind of psych you out. But, yeah, we're going to do this next episode, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Spray and pray out.